Ollie, um, it's been a whirlwind few days for you. How, how, how have you been since the Sunderland game? What's it been like? Yeah, it's, um, it's obviously still a bit surreal, but yeah, it just comes to terms with it and just really excited for maybe more opportunities. I was going to say, kind of, you, obviously in training between the two games, you te try not to get too carried away, don't you? But like the rest of us, you probably thought there's an opportunity for you to play possibly on Sunday. How, how have you approached training this week and, and does it make much of a difference? To, to your day to day when you've got that in mind. Um, well, obviously it's been a it's been a confidence boost and like your morale's high. But um, no, you just you take it day by day. Just keep working towards that goal. What's it been like for you? Because obviously, you, for a lot of the season, you, you, you tried to go out on loan, didn't you? And then the season yeah. got curtailed. So you, your opportunities were limited. You've been training every week, and then right at the end of the season, suddenly these opportunities have presented themselves. It must be it must be slightly odd. Yeah, no, it was slightly frustrating, but um, you just got to be prepared for it like the whole way through. And I was ready when I when I got called upon. So, what are the um, what are the coaches been like with you? I, I guess you've done quite a lot of work with Nance throughout the season, and obviously the the first team coaches now. What have they said to you in the sort of between the Sunderland game and now? Um, yeah, obviously Nance has been pushing me along. He's working very closely beside me. And um, the coach has just been very like, supportive, make sure, make sure I'm confident, make sure I'm ready, give me all the information I need. And do you feel confident, do you feel ready? The setup yeah. is obviously a challenge yeah. as we talked about before, but um, are you embracing that challenge? Yeah, yeah obviously if, if I'm needed I'm, I'm ready and I'm willing to work. The kind of elephant in the room obviously is that you, you come to the end of your contract in, in the summer, uh, it's only a couple of weeks away really from decision time, have you had any conversations, do you understand? Have you got an idea of what might happen? Um, not as of yet, um, but obviously I'll keep working until until right to the end of the season, and um, we'll see where that takes me. The Gillingham Games obviously a great opportunity for you to to try and prove yourself. It's going to be a tough one. Yeah. They're obviously a, a physical team. You can't have much of a tougher test as the young centre back. What are your thoughts on the game? Yeah, obviously they're going to be a big physical team, and I'm looking forward to that because it's a, it's obviously like you said it's a challenge and it's going to be exciting. So if, I, if I'm involved, yeah, I'll be ready. As a kind of um, academy graduate, how how pleasing is it for you to see the opportunities that everyone is getting now, whereas maybe in the past it might have been a lot more difficult to break into the first team? Yeah, very much so. It's it's good to see sort of the hard work paying off and young lads being given giving them chances and obviously um, taking them again. We wish you well on Sunday, mate. Good luck. Perfect, thank you.